to run a business that was not solely profit driven, something that maybe made a, a more lasting impression, made a difference in the world. Something that I could do regardless of profit. The, the passion was there. I came across coffee roasting and really saw that in the world of coffee, there was huge potential for change, social change, business change, quality change. And so I decided that that was going to be my life's great adventure and, um, and jumped in. I am totally in love with what we do, with coffee and the whole subject of coffee. And it's a company that I can be a part of that isn't affecting our world negatively. We only use the number one grade A bean. When the coffee is roasted, you get a really good quality cup of coffee. We believe in the Dietrich coffee roasting process, which is approximately 70% air roasted, 30% drum roasted, and in that combination creates the very best coffee. You start by putting the coffee up in the top hopper of the roaster. Once the roaster is up to temperature, you drop the beans into the roaster. The roaster is like a washing machine that spins around and around, and it keeps the beans rotating constantly. Inside the roaster, there's a ribbing that basically helps the beans go from front to back so that the whole time they're getting an even amount of flame and heat. Once the roast is done, which is approximately 14 minutes to 18 minutes, depending on the bean we're roasting, it then drops it into the cooling bin, which is what a lot of people think of when they think of roasting. They see that big, that big wand basically spinning around with the beans inside of it. All that's doing is cooling the beans off, and then once they're done being cooled, they're basically ready for us to package and send to customers. The cupping exercise is a lot of fun. We take ground coffee, steep it in water, take a, a cupping spoon, slurp the coffee, get it to spray the back of our tongue where we can sense the bitternesses, smell the aromas so when we break the crust of the coffee, we actually sniff and get that wonderful aroma. We make sample pots, we French press, we pull espresso shots, we do everything possible to taste our coffee in every way our customers would taste it. We're constantly trying to one-up our recipes, do them just a little bit better. And so that constant cupping to make sure that our coffee is the very best that we can create. I don't forget why we're shipping out the coffee. We do have a purpose and that our commitment is to the the countries and the farmers that we do get those beans from. Everywhere that grows coffee has challenges with their quality of life. The difference to us between a prosumer and a consumer is a consumer is just looking for a cup of coffee. As a prosumer of coffee, I want to make sure that when I drink a cup of coffee, I'm getting the very best that there is. And I also want to make sure that it's socially responsible. All of our coffee has to be the top grade specialty coffee. Because how can we turn a consumer into a prosumer if the coffee quality is not superior? Once that's taken care of, then we can really work on the issues that mean a lot to us. And they consist of three issues. The first one being certified organic. Organic is extremely important. A lot of people see only one side of the organic issue, and that is that you're putting harmful chemicals into your body. Chemicals that were outlawed in America years ago are being sent to third world countries, and they're being put on the crops. And coffee is the largest crop. The other side that a lot of people don't realize is those chemicals are being sprayed on the crops in these other countries. They get down into the ground water tables. The animals will drink it. The second one being shade grown. We only purchase coffee that is shade grown, that the rainforest has not been removed. Coffee that's grown in the shade grows a little slower. It is fuller tasting and it is not as acidic. The sun causes the acidity in the coffee. What a lot of people don't realize is while it grows slower, you still get the same amount of crops in a year and we protect our environment as well as making better quality coffee. And the third one and the most important being fairly traded or co-op traded. We make sure that the fairly traded coffee stays within the price that's set. Flavor is great, but you can't offer flavor, you can't offer quality without having somebody on the back end actually making a living to keep doing this. All of us drink coffee. Many of us know a coffee roaster. Many of us know or have heard of small plantations in third world countries. It's a very simple system to make a change in. And all it takes is responsible purchasing of the coffee that we drink every day.
created the Coffee Lovers Club because we saw a need to have a direct conduit of information to our consumers who now believe in our coffee and believe in our cause. And we can educate them. We can let them know what's going on with our company. And we can roast coffee and deliver it within 24 hours direct to the consumer. The Coffee Lovers Club is a program where our customers can get uh, two pounds of coffee, $24.90 a month. It's delivered to their door, freshly roasted, with all the, the three things we talked about, uh, shade grown, organic, and fairly traded. Also, a dollar per package goes towards an organization that they choose from our list, which right now is Agros and Coffee Kids. Agros is a company that actually goes in and it helps the farmers be able to get land. Their fundamental belief is that the person that works the farm needs to own the land. Their heart needs to be in the land. So they start with the core belief that we must somehow secure this land and sell it to the farmers, interest-free, so that somehow they get a portion of land ownership. The only thing that can change our world is for people to have ownership in it. In some of these places, the villagers never get an opportunity to actually own their future. And owning land is owning their future. Coffee Kids actually goes in and they do infrastructure. They build buildings and medical facilities in these villages. The thing that Coffee Kids does so well is to go into these villages and actually create infrastructure change that will help them with their efficiencies. Whether that be a schoolroom, whether that be a medical facility, water systems, solar systems, all the things that will make their life better long term, make them more sustainable. This is an organization who really cares about getting money, support, and infrastructure to these villages. It just makes it feel really good to know that your coffee, that your you're buying and you're purchasing is really helping those families in those other countries have a better quality of life. We are asking consumers to believe in us enough to make their coffee purchases count. I hope Camino Island Coffee Roasters can touch many people with the story that, that we have, that we really would like to not only be a coffee roaster, but that we would really like to make a difference. If our customers could understand our heart, they would understand why our coffee is the best coffee and why they need to be a part of it. As the president of Camino Island Coffee Roasters, I would like to invite you to be a member of our Coffee Lovers Club. For only $24.90, you can make a difference in the world. For $24.90, we will include two full pounds of the coffee of your choice. We'll grind it the way that you like it, and we'll ship it on the cycle that you specify, whether that be every four weeks or any other cycle. In addition, we'll send you a half pound of our coffee of the month, something that you don't normally receive, and we will cover the shipping, so that is not an additional charge. The most satisfying part of being a member of the Coffee Lovers Club is knowing that your coffee has been fairly traded, that the farmers that have done the work for you are getting a fair price for the product that they grow. In addition, you become a partner with us in helping these families that provide such a service. We will donate $1 of every package of coffee to either Agros or Coffee Kids organization. The choice is yours. Both of these organizations are recognized as making the biggest difference in the lives of the families that they serve and now you can become a partner with them. There are two ways that you can join the Coffee Lovers Club. You can log on to our website at www.camanoislandcoffee.com or fill out our brochure. If you'd like to call us at 866-833-0209, we will send you a brochure. Together, we can make a difference in our world. Thank <laughs> you.